guys, it's Tay from Tay Has Spoken and I'm coming to you with a video about the food apps that I frequently use. Um, I'm going to try to display the food app somewhere here on the sides. If not, I'm going to insert some pictures for you guys so you know what's what. Okay, so right now, um, if you download these apps, some of them, not all of them, you get free food. Okay, so the first app that I use frequently is um, Auntie Anne's. And if you saw one of my previous videos, which I'll link below, I talk about their pepperoni pretzel with love. I love it, love it, love it. Um, but they have pretzel bites and pretzel dogs and they have dipping sauces and cinnamon and almond slivered pretzels. Um, and usually they send you like buy a pretzel get a pretzel free a dollar off any pretzel drinks um, and then every um, every now and then they'll send you a couple freebies I believe I have a free pretzel right now you earn points every time you go and that'll get you more free pretzels more um, and more deals so that's one of the apps that I use and I probably use that um, maybe several times a month maybe like a couple times a month and you know the points build up kind of quick so especially if you go with people and they don't have the card you know just go ahead and let them scan scan your card get those extra points build up your points get free pretzels so that's the one and i apologize i'm looking down at my phone um now one that i use not often but um i kind of look and see because they the um coupons change frequently is the mcdonald's app um, one thing, if you drink a lot of their McCafes, they do have like a punch card on there. So if you buy, um, five, you end up getting one free. I think they should probably give you one free anyway, but whatever. So you buy five and each time you go, um, you let them scan your phone and that'll, that's like a punch. So, and usually the um, rewards are good for an expended period of time. But if, like you say, if you go a lot and you get a lot of frappes, then it kind of adds up. Um, they also have like... Um, you know, just like any other coupons, like purchase a large fry and, you know, get a dollar off this sandwich or purchase this sandwich and get a fry or, you know, breakfast items or juices or whatever. So there's kind of changed kind of frequently. Um, the one thing when I, um, <clears throat> first started using this app was the punch card. I, I don't know if it was certain McDonald's or people didn't know what they were doing, but I wasn't getting all my punches. So actually, when I got to like getting my fifth punch, I think I purchased three more and eventually the fifth one took and I got my free one. Um, but yeah, this one is just a little bit difficult to use. I'm sure that they'll work out the kinks, but um, I don't know if anybody else who's using this app has experienced in that, but you were not alone. Um, the other one that I use, oh, um, I use the Burger King app. The Burger King app gives you a lot of coupons, um, and I was having trouble with their app as well. What I like to do is, is I like to pull the coupon, not maybe the redeeming part, because it has a time limit on it, and once you, like, press the coupon, like, it counts down time, so if the line is long, you might run out of time before you get to the, the pay counter, right? So, I like to pull it up, but... I like to like press the redeeming time like when I'm when I'm next like I'm going right next I'm pulling up then I press it and then they can see the code now I did have a problem with this app as well the problem I was experiencing is when I was trying to pull up the coupons it seems like the closer I got to the store it's like the coupons wouldn't pull up like all of a sudden the app wasn't working like but it was so weird it's like and it didn't have to be one uh burger king it was you know a couple burger kings i did this too it's like as soon as i get close to the store it's like the app just didn't want to pull up um oh the next app that i don't use often but i just got it is the new sonic app um well it's new to me i don't know if it's new but it's new to me um and if you download it you actually get two free slushies um i'm not a big fan of sonic food but i do like their slushies and um you get two free another thing about their app is do not soon do not press anything until you get to the window or in front of a person and then you show them the thing and then you hit redeem because if you do it does not take you to like a timer like the 
Burger King app, it disappears. Like it says, okay, you redeemed it and it disappears. So I lost, um, I lost slushies doing that. Um, oh, the next one I use is, um, just as fairly new to me, is the Penn Station app. Now the Penn Station app, you earn points with this one as well. Um, and they give you a free six inch for downloading the app. So you can't beat that, right? So, um, you, and then every time you go, you accumulate points so you get free sandwiches and fries and cookies and stuff like that. So that's another app I use. Um, the next one is, I don't use this often, but I'm trying to use it because you actually have to kind of load money onto it, is the Starbucks app. Now, you load money onto the Starbucks card, you put that card, you load it into the app, and every time you go to Starbucks, you know, you use that card, you build up points, so on, so on and so forth. Now, um, what the Starbucks app also does is that it gives you freebies like free apps of the week, free music, you know, things like that. So it gives you other freebies within there. Um, if you get gift cards, you can load them on there. Um, I think you can send gift cards and you can also order online, I guess, maybe before you get there, maybe for the drive up windows or stuff like that. So that's another good, that's another good app if you are a frequent Starbucks drinker. Um, Another app that I use is I use the Domino's app. Now the Domino's app is another one where you accumulate points. Um, um, you can save your orders. If you have recent orders, you can save um, locations. If you like maybe order from work or order from home or wherever, um, you could do that and you accumulate points. Um, it does have coupons on there, so you can use coupons. Um, and um, you know, once you build up points, you get free pizza, things like that. Um, I use a lot of food apps. I think I download them. Um, I'm trying to, everybody tries to stay away from fast food, but you can't get away from it. So I do use these apps because they do give you a lot of coupons and I'm always trying to save money when I do go to fast food places. Um, one app that I do use that doesn't really give you any coupons but it does um but it does it's a good app to use is the jimmy john's app now i use this when i'm at work because i can order my sandwich i can order several sandwiches i can customize the sandwiches and then i can order them i can save locations i can pay through the jimmy john's app but usually no coupons no points anything like that jimmy john's is straightforward you can order from this app it will bring you your food and you're kind of done um and of course i use my grocery store apps um, just for coupons and things like that like we have Myers and Kroger's here Whole Foods um, and they just have a lot of coupons um, one other app that I use but not frequently is the Hardee's app and the Hardee's app gives you points every time you get near Hardee's you can kind of check in and you get 100 points and each 100 points there's like different tiers of things that you can get with those points I mean you can use as many points or as little points well 100 as you like and you could just kind of build those up and you really don't even have to buy anything with that app you can kind of check in and get 100 points so that one's kind of you nice I don't use that one as frequently frequently as I use maybe the pretzel app or the McDonald's app or the Burger King app but that's the food apps that I'm using tell me what food apps you're using maybe I need to get hip to one I hope you enjoyed this video I liked making it and I will see you in the next one bye guys